Okay. Are we all right? Um, yeah. Okay. Um, how should we? You don't want to do any establishing shots. We'll just do that. After. Okay, Adam, Jesse, really nice to to meet you guys. Um, now you're in Europe at the moment. You're on your world tour, aren't you? Um, but what you're what we want to talk about first of all is you've got a new single out at the moment. We do. You got a new single out with Rihanna. Mm -hmm. Um, tell me how that came about. Why Why did you decide to collaborate with Rihanna? Why not? She's, she's a babe. <laughs> she's beautiful and supremely talented and really unique and kind of interesting. I think that's what's kind of sold us on her. Is that she's a really, she's a really compelling person. I don't know. She's just very, in, I don't, in the pop landscape, I really, we really like her. And she's super cool and, uh, she had come to a show and a while back, and we thought, oh, she likes the band, so and we like her, so let's do it. And we did. So it's as easy as that. That's how it actually happens logistically. Uh -huh. Yeah, it, it's with us. I mean, we don't really want like like to collaborate with people unless it's genuine and it's truly something that we want to do. You know, it's not like a forced thing from the label or anything like that. We would never do anything that was too calculated in that way. Okay, and the song, um, if I never see your face again. Um, What's that all about? What is that song about? That song, <laughs> that song is kind of just about. It's just a really. It's kind of a fun dance song. It's just a flirtatious like, you know. I tend to write songs that are very impassioned and love songs, or I hate you, or I love you, or I don't know what to do, or and they're usually very competitive. I'm so sorry, I, I didn't <laughs> slept very much. But you know, I'm always thinking about things like that, and this is a little bit kind of a break from that. It's just kind of, hey, you know, I'm attracted to you, you're attracted to me, and what's, I don't know what the deal is, but I know that I like you, and I'm trying, you know, who knows, maybe this will be the last time we see each other. Yeah. One of those type of things, and that okay. happens, and you know, it's, it's, I, I just thought, why, let's just have fun with this one. Mm -hmm. Simple know? as that. Yeah. Okay, it's not your first collaboration though, is it? You've worked with other artists before. Who have you worked with? Is it Kanye West? Kanye you West know and uh, Alicia Keys. Did uh, we just sang? We sang a st old, we sang Wild Horses together, mm. uh, which was great. And Wild Horses, as in Stones, yeah. Rolling Stones. Eight. She she did this other version of it, and she she's awesome. I sat in a room with her and uh, worked on it together, and she's just so so talented. It was a cool thing. It was really, mm. I love working with people, and then. I mean, I've always thought she was great, but when you work, when you're finally in the room with the person, and they just blow your mind, it's mm. pretty cool. And working with artists like Rihanna and Kanye West, um, it's quite a different sound to your own. I mean, how does that how does that work? And why do you think, you know, what makes you think, oh, that's going to work with something that we've done? I mean, sometimes it doesn't. You know, I mean, it did. It did. We were fortunate. I think that we've been really fortunate actually to have collaborations that have been successful. But it doesn't always work. You know, you can't just put people in a room and expect it to, to click. Mm. Uh, I don't know. It's just one of those things where we got we lucked out, mm. but it was cool. 